and I think when I was researching this, that it was around Christmas when you, mm-hmm. you know, when you um, had to go to the ER. Um, was it about 97 farts in two days? Is that correct? Mm, it was around that total. I don't know. That whole entire period of time was like a complete blur because I was in the midst of completing so many orders. I was so motivated by the incredible amount of money that I was making at the time. Um, like, I'll be honest, I, I got a little bit, you know, crazy and overzealous with, with, with orders. And uh, I was, I was also so overwhelmed with how viral that story had gotten and how much media attention that I was getting. And it maybe perhaps got a little bit too much to my head. And I, yeah, I was definitely overproducing at the time. And I remember that night at the emergency room, it was a huge wake up call to me. And it really hit me that I have to put my health first. I have to put my body first. And so that was officially when I decided that I would retire and refocus my energy into a different direction. That's when I really started to refocus on my fart jar NFT project, which ended up doing really successfully. I was really happy about that. And when I started to really refocus on, you know, back on my fan subscription website and growing different features for the website, helping expand that. And, you know, the fan subscription website Website's going really great. We have over a hundred thousand members. The money that I made from selling the fart jars, I put back into development of the website, so I can give women and men on the site the the opportunity to make as much money as I have selling my fart jars, so they can do what I do. So they can also be their own entrepreneurs. That makes me happy. That gives me a sense of purpose. So yeah, I'm you know I'm launching more new developments and features on the site coming very soon. One very big one. So there's lots of like very exciting things coming in the future. And I think that it's pretty crazy that my farts have been able to open so many doors in my life. Uh, I never thought I'd be able to say that.